Now, here are some of the top stories overseas as we go internationally. <laughs> some tensions start to rise in the Korean Peninsula as the two Koreans were test fired with missiles one after another in a series for tit for tat moves. This all took place local time at 6.51 a.m. in the morning. We're being told that North Korea fired at least 23 missiles. But those launches came hours after North Korea and South Korea warned that nuclear weapons are going to pay the most horrible price in history if the two start to join together. And now, let's go to my Aunt Tammy Souza with the 7 Day Forecast from CBS3. Take it away, my pretty. So our rain chances today have a big old fat goose egg all the way through today into tomorrow. Rain chances after that, nothing for Thursday, so Thursday's game looks good. Nothing for Friday as you're relaxing and celebrating a new championship, we do hope. Nothing on Saturday, and what you see on Sunday represents later Sunday night, and there is a small chance on Monday and Tuesday as a front comes through. So let's walk you through the weather. We do have those winds out of the north. They are very, very light winds, mainly sunny, just a few high clouds this afternoon drifting through. We go into tonight. First pitch, it is going to be mainly clear, but just a few clouds from time to time. We head into tomorrow. Looks like a beautiful start to the day. Sunshine with a few high thin clouds. We get into tomorrow night. First pitch, totally clear there. Winds are light and out of the northeast. So again, it will be 65 at first pitch tonight. It is going to be mainly clear with a few clouds from time to time. 60 tomorrow night at first pitch. We should probably just ignore this, but if they have to go back to Houston, 65 degrees and partly cloudy skies. Across the region today, 72 in Philadelphia. That is well above average by the 68 down the shore. Great day there and 67 in the Lehigh Valley. Tonight, a little cooler, but this is when you wake up tomorrow morning. 48 degrees, becoming mostly clear, which is absolutely beautiful out there. We're looking at 69 tomorrow, so it's just a tad cooler, but still well above average. 70 for your Friday. The weekend in the mid and upper 70s, we could be getting close to records in the upper 70s and near 80. And don't forget, you got to flip that clock back one hour when you go to bed Saturday night because daylight saving time ends and we start next week with just a teensy tiny chance. Thank you, Auntie Tammy. Tonight is the Powerball Jackpot. The estimated jackpot is worth up to $1.2 billion. <laughs> Now, here are the winning numbers from Halloween. The numbers are 13, 19, 36, 39, 59. And the red number is the same as the first number. Good luck to everybody who plays the lottery. <laughs> we'll be back, my pretties, with more of our news broadcasts. So stay tuned. <laughs>